Hey everyone, I'm Mr. Vishwas and welcome to this brand new course where we are going to learn how to build AI applications with Next.js. Now, a few years ago, if you wanted to add AI features to your app, you would need a data science team, months of development, and probably a small fortune in infrastructure. Today, it's a completely different story. We are living in this incredible moment where AI has become accessible to every web developer. You can build AI-powered applications that write like humans, understand context, analyze images, have conversations, and make intelligent decisions. And the best part is you can do it all without a PhD in machine learning. But how do we go from traditional web development to building these intelligent features? Well, that's where the right tools make all the difference. For this course, I have chosen two powerful tools that work beautifully together. First, Next.js, the React framework that many of us already use and love. It gives us everything we need for modern web applications right out of the box. And second, the AI SDK from Vercel. It's a library that handles all the complex parts of AI integration, so we can focus on building great AI features. Let me explain what the AI SDK actually brings to the table. It is organized into three main parts. First, we have AI SDK Core, and this is the foundation, which gives us a unified API for generating text, structured objects, tool calls, and even building AI agents. All the background operations you'll need start here. The beautiful thing is that it works the same way regardless of which AI provider you're using. Second, we have AI SDK UI. This is a set of framework agnostic hooks for quickly building chat and generative UI. Instead of managing message state, handling streaming updates, and dealing with all the complexity of real-time interfaces, you get hooks that just work. It's like having a UI expert on your team who has already solved all the hard problems. Finally, we have AI SDK RSC for React Server Components. It's an alternative to AI SDK UI, but only for frameworks that support React Server Components. Since this is experimental, we will focus on the core and UI parts in this course. Because the AI SDK is built by the same team that created Next.js, it integrates seamlessly with all the Next.js patterns we already know and use. Now that you understand the tools we'll be using, let's talk about who should take this course. If you're a Next.js developer who's been curious about AI but hasn't known where to start, this course is for you. Maybe you've seen all the AI demos online and wondered how to build something similar. Or perhaps you have tried working directly with APIs and found it overwhelming. This course is designed to guide you from a complete beginner to confidently building AI-powered apps with Next.js. I strongly encourage you to follow along and write the code yourself. However, all the code will be available on GitHub for you to reference, and a link to that is in the description box. Before we start building, let's make sure we are on the same page about prerequisites. You need to be comfortable with modern JavaScript, things like async await, array methods, restructuring, and other ES6 Plus features. You should know the React fundamentals, how components work, passing props, managing state, and especially hooks. We'll be using hooks extensively, including some custom ones from the AI SDK. You need to know Next.js, particularly the app router. You should understand how file-based routing works, how to create API routes, and the basics of server and client components. I have an extensive Next.js course on the channel, and I highly recommend you check it out. As for TypeScript, some experience will help, but don't worry if you're not an expert. I will explain the TypeScript specific parts so you can learn as we go. All right, with this introduction in mind, let's proceed to setting up our development environment. 